Good morning, everyone, and please stand for the prayer. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. God, our Father, giver of life, we entrust the United States of America to your loving care. You are the rock on which this nation was founded. You alone are the true source of our cherished right to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Send your spirit to touch the hearts of our nation's leaders. Open their minds to the great worth of human life, the responsibilities that accompany human freedom. Remind your people that true happiness is rooted in seeking and doing your will. Through the intercession of Mary Immaculate, patroness of our land, grant us the courage to reject the culture of death. Lead us into a millennium of life. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Please remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please recite the mission statement of St. Joseph Hill Academy. Good morning, I'm Nikki. Please. And I'm Julia. And you're watching Hill, Hill TV. TV. Please note that Hill TV is only able to accept announcement requests from faculty members. We cannot, ex we cannot accept announcements sent in by club, club officers, team captains, or other students. Remember to send all Hill TV announcements to news at scjhill.org by 7.30 a.m. to be sure they get added to the script. Announcements sent to other email addresses won't be seen by the script writer. Anything received after 7.30 cutoff may not get, may not get announced until the following day. Today is day six. There will be a photography club meeting for old and new members in room 227 at 245. Any junior interested in running for vice president must prepare a one minute presentation of the photo that best represents their qualifications for VP. There will be a fashion and sewing club meeting tomorrow, Tuesday, September 20th in Madonna Hall from 224 to three. All are welcome. Now it's time for this week's weather time. Hi guys, good morning and welcome back to Weather Time. I'm your host, Sean Wood. Let's get into this week's weather. So this week's weather is going to be not very pretty. Once again, it's going to be very, very cloudy all week and it's going to rain on Thursday. So on Friday, unfortunately, it's going to be 66 degrees and it may even drop down to 52. So we're getting into that fall weather soon. But here are the temperatures for this week. I hope everyone has a great week. Stay safe, stay warm on Friday because you're going to need the warmth, and I will see you next week. Bye, guys. Do you like to draw and paint? Then come attend the first art club meeting on Friday, September 23rd at Madonna Hall from 2.45 to 3.30. All are welcome. There will be a meeting for any students interested in being a member of the American Cancer Society Club tomorrow, Tuesday, September 20th, after school. Location of the meeting will be announced tomorrow during Hill TV. If you are unable to attend, please email Mrs. Holst. The American Can Cancer Society Club will be selling t-shirts, which can be worn every Friday in the month of October in place of the white knit uniform shirt. Shirts will be sold for $20 and can be ordered using the link found in the announcement email. Orders must be placed by Friday, se September 30th. More information will follow regarding our annual fashion show on October 15th and the Marking Stripes Walk on October 16th. If you have any questions or concerns, please see Ms. Holst, Ms. Puglisi, Ms. Guono, or any ACS executive. Thank you in advance for your continued support for the ACS Club. There is a Project Hospitality meeting this Wednesday, September 21st, after dismissal. Gather outside Campus Ministry Office and find a room that is available on the fourth floor. All captains are encouraged to join. Anyone interested, please come to the meeting and please continue to make sandwiches for Project Hospitality. There is a meeting on Thursday, September 22nd to all those interested in helping out at Seton. Please come to this meeting. The director, Dr. Diane Toronto, will come to speak with you. And now we'll hear from our president and vice president of the student council. Good morning, guys. Student council here to talk to you about our welcome back carnival. When and where is the carnival? September 30th, 7 to 9 p.m. in the upper parking lot. Who can come? Every Hilltopper is allowed up to two guests upon entry who just must provide school ID. Where can you get your tickets? 
You can buy tickets online. There will be a QR code on the flyer, and a link will also be sent to you. Upon every purchase, every person will receive five tickets. What can these tickets be used for? Hot dog, cotton candy, and popcorn. There's also going to be an ice cream truck, which is not included, so be sure to bring some cash. And what will make this feel like a real carnival? There's going to be a lot of games, including inflatable ones. You can win tickets to buy prizes like candy and baked goods. Welcome back carnival is going to be a ton of fun, so be sure to pop out and bring your friends. <laughs> Thank you for all those who signed up at Casa Belvedere for their Festa and Morti d'Italia events. This coming Saturday, September 24th, and Sunday, September 25th, please remember to go on time if you signed up and log your hours. There is a Scarecrow Festival at Blue Heron Park this coming Saturday, September 24th from 11 to 4 p.m. Please see Erin Hagen for more information. Rain date for this event is Sunday, September 25th. Do you know how to knit or crochet? Do you want to learn? The Crochet and Knitting Club will be having its first meeting on Thursday, September 22nd in room 223 at 3 p.m. We, we will be learning how to crochet and or knit and will donate our finished works to charity. If you have any questions, please email Anissa Arman. Hi girls, the Girls Who Code Club will be having their first, having its first meeting next Wednesday, September 21st, right after school in room 223. The purpose of the club is to close the gender gap in technology. You'll engage in fun online coding tutorials and interactive activities and learn about inspiring role models in the tech industry. Hope to see you there. There will be a Kairos fourth day meeting on September 21st at 7 p.m. on Zoom. All who have attended a Kairos retreat are, are welcome to attend. Link will be sent out the day of the meeting. Now it's time for Maluza Mondays. Hi girls, good morning. Um, happy Monday and I, we hope you have a good week. Um, so I've been seeing that um, events and activities are certainly underway. Um, there were a lot of club meetings last week. There are several this week, and I've just heard of um, a bunch of them uh, on announcements. So, you know, as I've told, told the freshmen, the freshmen in particular, but this goes for all grade levels, get involved because that's when you get the most out of Hill. So, you know, Hill is putting these opportunities out there for you. You know, join them. You know, go out of your comfort zone. Join something that maybe you didn't think you would like. And, and you know what? Maybe you won't, but maybe you'll be surprised and find that you really do. So, you know, I'd like to see you um, all involved. That would be great. Um, the other thing that I want to mention also underway are our sports. So um, our soccer team is 1-0, and and um, they have a game uh, against C tonight, um, and that goes for varsity and JV. So they're off to a good start. So, um, you know, uh, make, let's make sure we cheer them on. Um, our cross country had their first meet at Van Cortland Park this weekend, and uh, they did they did very well. Okay, they made the school proud. So, um, so we're good to, glad to see them underway. Um, and volleyball, um, I, I, I was fortunate enough, I was able to go to the volleyball games this weekend, and um, it, it was just great, like watching just the camaraderie, and, and, and the girls are really good. So, you know, um, our varsity is one and one. Um, you know, our, they've, they've done well. Our JV um, is 0 and 2, but they lost some really close games. So, you know, there's a lot of potential there. Uh, the girls are good, they have the skills. So, you know, it's just a matter of time, girls, hang in there, you can definitely do this. Um, and tennis um, is uh, one, they're one and two, so let's go tennis, okay? Let's cheer them on and, um, you know, let's get that record um, up there. But I know that they, they are playing well, they're certainly trying, and so it's just a matter of time. So let's, uh, let's cheer them on as they play um, uh, Xavier tomorrow. Um, and um, Michelle and uh, Kristen mentioned about the carnival, so please keep that in mind. It's going to be a lot of fun. And uh, don't forget, girls, that tomorrow we're taking ID photos and pictures. That does not hold for the seniors. Okay, the seniors have their senior portraits, which you know have been taken separately, um, you know, over the summer. So tomorrow, um, you need to, um, girls, wear your blazers. Okay, grades nine through eleven. Okay, and uh, you'll have the pictures taken. Seniors, you can wear your gym uniforms tomorrow. So I wish everybody a great week, and uh, I'll see you next week. The Literary Club will be having their first meeting on September 21st, right after school in room 430. The Literary Club publishes Hill's annual literature and art magazine, The Peak. If you are interested in joining the Literary Club this year, please fill out, fill out the membership link provided. We're going to use this list for emails, so even if, if you were a member last year, do it again this year. 
Remind you that the Diabetes Club will meet in the chapel on the fourth floor today at 3. Happy birthday over the weekend to Isabel Ramos and Ariana Nugin. And happy birthday today to Sophia Milton, Olivia Bayer, and Maureen Gay. Today's famous birthday is Jimmy Fallon. Today's national days are Talk Like a Pirate Day and National Butterscotch Pudding Day. I'm Nikki. And I'm Julia. And you just watched Hill, Hill TV. TV. Bye.